This is Elizabeth the Manx Polar Trek teacher reporting from the Nellicatuck in Barrow, Alaska. Today is a sunny, beautiful day on June 21st, 2008. Nellicatuck is a festival that celebrates the whale. The Inupiats feast on the whale. Today we are celebrating with two whales. All the people in the community bring their own bowls and blankets to prepare for the crew members to serve them. And speaking with 86 year old Arnold Brower, a very prominent member of the community. We've got nine whales this spring. You're the captain of the whaling crew? Oh, yeah. I, I, I'm What's the, the captain. name of your, cap, your crew? ABC crew. And what is your job as the captain? I train them. I train them, uh, teach them uh, everything I know. I, I learned from. Uh, from the past. This is too well. Mm -hmm. Sharing with people uh, the biggest part, portion of the whale. It's a lot of work, but uh, we share it with them. This animal is a uh, crucial animal. There's no animal like it. Welcome to Lewis Brower's family. This is the family. Uh, the, the community family. I could look See around in every corner anywhere. and go name a first, second, First cousin or second cousin on both the family side. Yeah. My name is Roxanne Brower and I'm Lewis Brower's wife. Um, we do from the start of the well, we go down and I help them. I wait for the guys to cut it up and I get the intestines and I clean them out out there on the ice and I make them hot tea, coffee, and we make them some first boiled muk, that's the unali. And we feed them, make sure everything's okay, and then we come back, then we go to the house and we start getting ready to we serve got the community. Coming in, so we please cook all the meat fresh, all the muktuk fresh. Clear. That's the only time you could cook the muktuk is when, you, when it's fresh, yeah, when it's fresh yeah. caught. Mm -hmm. And oh, um, we then we, in, uh, we get everything ready, cook all the uh, uh, intestines, the meat, the muktuk. And the heart, the tongue, we cook all that, then we make bread bread and donuts and we, we pick a day to serve the community. They all come to the house and then get their share and go back out. They, wow. all, they all get one bite for each mm -hmm. person. And after that they put everything, all the, the day they catch the whale they, or the day after they put all this meat muktuk in the ice cellar and then we leave it in there until the, today, the preparation for Nalukuda. Francis Brower, I'm 11. I'm going to 6th. Six. 6th grade, and what's your favorite part about this festival? <laughs> I think I like the, like the most is the blanket toss. Well, there's a lot of people gathering and there's like strings, mm -hmm. like in loops. And one, pers or one person grabs a hand on, and one person goes on the blanket and when they start counting to 3 and then once they count to 3, the person on the blanket goes like real high. Said I was on top of the world. It was, it was just, just the thrill of the moment. Yeah. Not, nothing else. This is a fun day for you, huh? Oh man, uh, you gotta express your 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 exhaustion at the right moment. And there it was. This is Polar Tech teacher Elizabeth Yeah. If you want more information, please go to the website www.polartech.com. I'm leaving you today with the blanket toss. This is the grand finale of the Nova Kentucky year. It's hard to believe that it's after 9 p.m. It's a beautiful, sunshiny night.